so we have well first welcome to our vlog i know we haven't done one of these and sorry it's getting dark in a very long time but um i figured that we would do it so it's the weekend and y'all i'm so sick of being in the house well we were so sick of being in the house so um we decided to take a little road trip down to jacksonville florida and just we just rented an airbnb in this condo and just came here because even like the point of coming was just to get out of the house because we had been in the house as you know post covid and just i just needed a breath of fresh air and now we're here so we got here the condo is so nice guys I wish I would have been able to get some footage of it while it was clean because we got in at like 12 o'clock at night. So we, everybody jumped straight to bed and um, so the rooms are not clean. However, I guess I can still show you, I can still show you. So let me start from the front door. Cut these lights on, but it's so nice. Whoever, so this is the entrance, this is the door. And so then you have the living room. I hope I can get in it. You have the living room, dining room, kitchen. Say hey girls. Hi. Say hey grandma. Hello. Hello. And then um, it has three bedrooms and three baths. So this is one room and then it has the bathroom let me see let me turn the lights on i guess it's both of them really nice walk-in shower this is my grandma's room and then you come down the hall so cute guys whoever like really you can tell it was renovated did a really good job this is the room that the girls are staying in but they only slept they slept in the same bed together yeah they slept in the same bed together and then they have their own bathroom and this condo is literally right off of the beach so if the weather was permitting which is not we would we would be able to walk like straight to the beach okay so now we're in the master bedroom this is the entryway this is i believe a closet oh don't break the door oh it goes that way this is a closet that's just the toilet and this is the bathroom it has a walk-in shower and tub and you keep walking this way that's the other closet and then this is the bedroom again guys it looked a lot nicer than this <laughs> but we um you know we just got into bed we were tired we were tired um thankfully um my grandmother is down here with us for a couple weeks because this this moving from two kids to three kids now it's a little bit more challenging so they have all the their doctor's appointments and dental appointments and it was just hard for me to have all three of them because i can only take the child to the doctor appointment so it's, it's not like i can leave bring sarge with me or bring Ami. so she came to oh no oh Ugh. this guy he throws up all day he gets his finger in his mouth and then he throws up. Throws up all day. Where the trash can at? Oh. So yeah, today, honestly, we really just came down here. It's like a five hour drive from where we're at. We really just came here to get out, but I don't know. We, so we don't really have any concrete plans. We probably go downtown if the weather permits, but yeah, just chilling. Say hello, Mr. Levin. Sorry. Oh yeah. Oh, hey, what up? Watching uh, Justice League, Dark Side. What up, what up? <laughs> yeah, so my grandma cooked breakfast. We're about to eat, or the girls already eat, and I'm about to eat. 
and then we'll see what we have planned for today. All right, see you later. Yeah. Today going to Amazon. Amazon. Wait. You see, Amazon. they know. Why do they even know about Amazon? Because mommy is always on Amazon. We about to go to the museum. The museum and the yeah. channel. <laughs> what? <laughs> we going to the museum, Ami? Yeah. Yeah, we going to the museum. Um, so it is really cool and windy, and so um, again because it was an impromptu trip. Didn't really look at the weather that much, um, but I will say that if you do come here during a time like where it's really warm, it is a lot of activities to do, like outside activities, especially for kids. But one thing that I found for us to do that's indoors is called Mosh um, Museum of Space and History. Yeah, so we're about to take the kids there. Um, Actually, so hopefully we have some hopefully it's interesting and it's fun. Hey, baby Sorry, Jay Yeah, and guess I'm holding him right now because he's sleep. I'll put him in his car seat before you say anything uh, yeah, yeah. Huh? It's baby brother Okay, so okay, we're about to head out Grandma Sorry. Okay, baby. Hello Mommy on water. Mommy. Okay, I'll give you some water. All right, we'll see you can get to the museum. All right, so we have gotten to the museum. Right. Museum. Museum. We're here at the museum. Come on. We just got here, just pulled up. Got the kids. Mommy's in the front. Big girl Kenzie's walking. Right, I'm trying to get you guys a picture of the the front of the museum. Here it is. So yeah, it looks really nice out here. What what did you say this area reminded you of? Mine. Huh? Downtown Miami. Downtown. Oh, well, I wouldn't know anything about downtown Miami. Miami, but not downtown. So, so we're about to go ahead and head in. Um, I just probably pulled the camera back out when we're actually in the place. It kind of seems a little packed. The parking lot is kind of full, but we'll see. All right. You want to take a picture by the wheel? No. <laughs> this is my this is my photogenic daughter that wants to take a picture everywhere. Look, Kenzie, what is that? It's a whale. So this is the first. Um, this is the first part of I guess like the museum. It's called Atlantic Tail. So, all right, y'all ready? Come on, Ken. Yeah. Wow. What is that? Oh. It's a dolphin. <laughs> they don't play boy. Oh, wow. What is that? It's a whale, Ami. You see it? I don't think Ami like it. Yeah, so this part pretty much has like pictures of whales how they migrated and all of that type of stuff so this is cool hold on i don't know you gotta follow it's like little feet on the ground that you have to follow let me put my mask on wow look what is that it's the ocean. It's the ocean. The ocean is too. That's too small to be the ocean. What? What? Wow. 
Ami, mean, you want to get out? Okay, I'm going to get out. Can you get her out, boo? Ready? This is cool. So, it's really like, just for people that do want to come, it's not like an aquarium. Oh, no, no, no. Get back in here, girls. I mean, I mean, uh, uh, no talking. Come, come. Um, it's really like a museum. Like, it's like pictures and diagrams. It's not an aquarium. Just to make sure we, <laughs> make sure we let you know. What is that? Let's see. So these are like different ecosystems that show, but you have to like find the animal in it. So it says, hidden in plain sight, can you find me? I'm showing off skills that keep me safe from predators. So he's camouflaged. Oh, I see him. I see him. There he is. He's inside of the log. He's inside of the log. He's a frog. Or is that a frog? No, it's a toad. See the toad? You see it? Can you find him? Yes. Oops, sorry. He's a turtle. He's a turtle. He's a turtle. He's a turtle. So to be, be corrected, they do have some parts of the museum where there are actual animals. So we are in like the part where the like animals that are native to Florida. Yes. So they have. What is it? I don't know if you can see the what owl. Is it, is it bird? Oh my God. You see the owl. And then you can see the turtle dove. Let's see. I mean, you see the bird? Can you see the bird? Yeah. So they have all different types of birds, right? Come on, we'll go this way. You want to go to that one? Okay. Yeah, so. to go find something to eat and then after that whoo, mm, that yeah we're gonna go take a nap because yeah. mama is tired <laughs> mama is tired sorry jay went back to sleep Ami's hungry everybody's hungry i don't know we find a little little knickknack place huh Oh, I'm so tired, y'all. Hey, dude, the weather is like dreary, which like make you want to go sleep even more. But, like that, I feel refreshed. I had a good about hour and a half. Two, I don't even know how long I was sleep, to be honest. Nap. Now we're looking at house tours. <laughs> looking at house tours um i don't think that we've even told you guys but um 
we are building a third home. Hey girls, and what I mean by a third home, hold on, I'm cutting lights so I'm, I'm giving the girls a snack because y'all like, I think they really want to like, I think they really want, okay, let me back back up because what I'm about to say won't make sense if I don't finish what I was saying first. Hold on. I'm going to cut the lamp on for you, okay? But we are... Huh? Okay, I'm just going to put the lamp on. Not the, not, the, not the big light, okay? I just need the big light to see. Oh. But, um, so we are building our forever home right now. Um, it'll be done beginning of... Within the first week of November. Um, dang it. I don't want to move their stuff, but let's see. Yeah, it'll be done the first week of November. And yeah, so we are building a house. And I know some of you are probably thinking, didn't y'all just move into the house you're in now? We've been in the house that we're in now for about three years. Is that a plug? Oh, sorry y'all. I'm trying. Let me just set this right here. Okay. So. Okay, I got a, I got a light right here. Okay, you need to start. Oh, how are you gonna turn the camera? Mm -hmm. I see. Oh, now you have a. Is it not working? Oh. Okay. That's it. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. 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 But, um, so yeah, we have been in the home building phase, honestly, for months. Like, we have went through maybe two or three builders until we finally settled on a builder, a location, um, where we want our floor plan to be. I've already been to the design, um, the design center. I, I'm trying to figure out the word because... It's not, it wasn't with this company, with this builder, it wasn't really a design center. So it's, it was weird. Like all the other companies I've worked with, um, it was a centralized design center, but this one wasn't. But anyway, so yeah, we've already went through the whole process. So now we're just, they just broke ground um, and they broke because we, we have, we have in a basement. And so they just broke ground. And so it's going to take them until about November to get finished. So I'm super excited about that. The house that we live in now, we're going to rent it out like we rented out our first home. So, we're going to keep it. Yeah, so, the re now I can get to what I was about to say. So, in this room that, they, that they're that uh, staying in now at the Airbnb, um, it's two full-size beds in a room. And so, at first, I wanted the girls to have their own room. But they don't want their own room. They want to be in a room together. So, the rooms, as far as in the new house, I was like, well... I had already bought Mackenzie a full size bed like probably like five months ago. And I was gonna put it up, then I decided not to put it up because I didn't think Ami was ready to get out of her crib and they share rooms right now. So I was like, okay, well we can just keep the full size bed when we get to our new house. But um but then it was like, okay, well dang, they want to share rooms with that fit. Like will two full size bed look right? And when I came into these rooms, I was like, wait, actually, two full-size beds in the room does look right if you have the space. And I'm trying to remember our square footage in their bedroom. And so I, I told Sarah, I said, I'm going to go and look because they had a house built that's similar to ours, but they just sold it. So I'm not for sure how long they're going to keep it open, but like take some um, measurements to see if I can fit two full-size beds in their bedroom because they are just loving it even though they're sleeping in the same bed y'all like the two beds yeah okay. i mean you like the two beds yeah 
Like that picture. Yeah. So I really want to do that, but if not, they're gonna get two, two, um, two twins beds, and I, and the bed that I bought from Mackenzie. To be honest, I don't know where I'm gonna put that bed at. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna do. I might resell it because it's like literally everything is still in the box. The mattress, the the box, everything is still in the box. Um, but these girls took a nice nap. And then they still don't want to get out of bed. <laughs> I think they just like sleeping in the bed together. They do not want to get out of the bed. I was like, do y'all want to come to the living room? No, we want to get in the bed. You just want to stay in the bed? Can you eat these? All right, good morning. I forgot to end the vlog yesterday. So it's Sunday and we are going to leave sometime today or tonight. We just ate breakfast. Hey cutie. Hey cutie. There that smile go. <laughs> the girls stay up again like late last night again, so they're still asleep. Matter of fact, let me show you. It's so funny. I just think that they just so love sleeping in the bed together. <laughs> But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. I hope you guys just enjoyed this little snippet. Again, we didn't do much, um, but it's just been good to be away and relaxed. So um, I hope you make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell so that you can get uh, a notification whenever we upload or whenever I upload new videos. And I will see you next Wednesday. Peace.